This is not financial advice, not legal advice for entertainment educational purposes only, and anything I say is my opinion. Please don't make any financial decision based on anything I say in these videos. That being said, hit the like button, subscribe button, all that YouTube algorithm stuff so you get the videos I put them out. So you don't think and see me analyzing that data. Like I tell every day, the data released us is false. and then it gives a false narrative of the market so we can make bad trading decisions. Listen, I, this is my first video of the day and my last video of 2023. I want to wish everybody a happy new year. And I'm going to tell you something. A lot of us have lost a lot of money on this AMC play in 2023, 2022, 2021. I'm down over 95%. But like I tell you all the time, I look at it as tuition. I've made some of my money back in the overall market because I learned how to trade. I learned things that I was not aware of 30 months ago, different types of option plays. I learned how to read the charts. I mean, I got a... Uh, a PhD in the stock market over the last 30 months. And even though we still lost a lot of money on AMC in 2023, I believe that 2024 is going to be even better. And I'm not telling you to buy, hold, or sell AMC. I'm just telling you that I believe 2024 is going to be a whole lot better. I am very proud of the retail community because I'm going to tell you something. The bad actors are terrified of us. Okay? And you know why? Because every single day we uncover some type of fraud, some type of corruption. We have learned all their secrets. And the SEC, the DOJ, the FBI, the CIA can't say they, that they were not aware of the fraud and corruption. When you go to Reddit, you go to Stock Twitch, you go to any social media platform, Twitter, YouTube, you have a whole lot of retail investors who are uncovering the fraud and they're reporting on it. And I believe because of our tenacity, we are forcing the SEC to act. And I think that is great because I believe if they enforce the new short selling transparency rules in 2024, it could put, maybe not put an end to, to the naked shorting, but it would slow it down immensely. Will the bad actors find a way around it? Of course they will because they are criminals and criminals always find a way to get around the law. I mean, that is just what they do. That is why they are criminals. Now, what we need is law enforcement officers who are going to arrest these criminals. And until we get that, I don't really see too much happening. What we've seen in 2023 is that even though the bad actors have got a court with their hand in the cookie jar, breaking the law and stealing from retail investors and pension funds, the fines are usually only a small percentage of what they make from robbing retail investors and pension funds. So instead of acting as a deterrent, it more or less emboldens the bad actors to keep robbing and stealing from retail investors anyway you guys have a great new year enjoy your family don't get too drunk tonight and let's make a lot of money in 2024 and let's keep uncovering the fraud and corruption in the market and force the sec the doj and the fbi to do their job and enforce the laws of the United States of America. Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I really appreciate you guys on this journey with me. I really do. You guys have changed my life. Anyway, have a great day. God bless. And I appreciate y'all on this journey with me.